It's the chase! And look at these electric turtle guys, or Koopas. These guys are pretty cool, honestly. They have those electric shells and stuff. Oh, watch this. It's the big showdown in silence. Also, this part, I don't know why, this kind of reminds me of Moses. <laughs> I like when it separates the, the, uh, the Red Sea, I think. I think it was the Red Sea or Mediterranean. It was probably the Red Sea. I could be wrong. I don't know. What happened? Did the perpetrator get away? Get away? Did you see that shit? That monstrosity right there? So I think this I might be able to finish in uh, not too long. I mean, granted, you, geez, it's 2.40 right now, 20 minutes. That should be enough time to literally just beat this guy and do the cutscene. And then right at, and then after I do this, then the next gameplay series will be definitely talking about this serious topic that I need to talk about. Amazing, what a specta spectacle. Is this a new show of ours? You guys are great. Whoever hired you needs to, needs a raise. I love how you play the fearless hero and he's like a bad version of you, but you both look the same and stuff. Well, as a director of this park, I want you to ensure your success. So how about I provide you with a hero's vehicle? Follow me. So now this, this kind of gameplay changes on how to do this boss battle. It's pretty cool, honestly, though I don't know if it would be a little frustrating, like a little hard on the controls and stuff, but I think I might be able to do it. But pretty unique how they did it, though, so... Oh, shit. I have to... I have to take care of these things. Okay, come on. Give me another. Give me another. Oh, shit. You got it. Another. Oh, shit. Oh shit, fuck! I think I got hit. Oh damn, that's, that's okay. I did this level so many times, so when I was little I actually, or when I was a kid, I actually knew where these things were coming from. There we go. Ah, oh, fuck! Okay. Fuck, I missed. I think I might die on this one. What the fuck? Oh, shit. This doesn't count. Oh shit! Fuck. That was close. Alright. Oh god. Fuck, where is it coming from? Where is it coming from? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Looks like we're gonna die in this level, that's what's gonna happen. Oh shit! Yes! I missed! Oh, okay. oh my god, I should have just saved up that shit for. I can't fucking block that shit! Oh, 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 oh. Die! I did it! I did it! I was one health dead! Uh, one health before death! Oh, I'm so happy.
Oh, look at this. <laughs> so this is the very first introduction of Bowser Jr. This is his first game he was in. Leave my mama alone, you bad man. I won't let you take Mama Peach away. Mama? <laughs> mama Peach? When I draw with this, all my wishes come true. A strange old man in a white coat gave it to me. A strange old man in a white coat? But why would you pretend to be Mario? Papa told me everything. He said, Mario's a bully. He never fights fair. He said, Junior, you gotta try to outsmart Mario. So I tried to get Mario sent to prison. But they didn't lock him up. And now he came to steal Mama Peach again. Corona Mountain. Yeah, that was it. Honestly, I thought Bowser Jr.'s uh, voice was actually not bad, you know? I mean, like... Uh, like I, it was actually pretty good, honestly. Now, Peach, she kind of did sound like a dumb blonde, so it was also not like good voice. I mean, they also kept that voice in the future Mario games, sadly. But, oh well. So yeah, that was it. They defeated Mecha Bowser and when I was just only a health away from dying. What, what a nice way to end it. So it's 2.46 right now. Uh, I did finish talking about that YouTuber. I guess that's, all, that's what this is all going to be just about. I guess I did talk about my certain videos, scheduling, and... Um, I don't know if I've already talked about this kind of stuff. But you know what? I don't want to stop... Uh, well. Actually, you know what? I don't want to stop right now, because there's something else that I want to, I want to talk about uh, quickly, and it's uh, I'll basically be doing like collecting fruit to get some root points, because I do need some strength for it. Oh, you want to work for me a little bit? I love three to bring me some fruit. Okay, I need some. Durian, bring me three, would you? I'm not gonna do durian. Just bring the fruit here and put it in the basket, okay? Durians are those spiky fruits. They're called the king of fruits, and they also they actually smell really bad. But I'm not gonna do these because these are the only kinds of fruits that you can't carry with you. So I'm gonna only do the easy ones like bananas or something that you can carry. Anyway. You don't have access to the, also to the rocket nozzle just yet. So, anyway, what I want to talk about is that, okay, so there's this, there's this, like, YouTuber girl, another YouTuber girl that, um, that I also, did, like, you know, discovered, and she's also really hot and stuff, and believe it or not, I actually just found her again while viewing on DeviantArt. So basically I was just scrolling through DeviantArt, just looking at stuff. I like going through DeviantArt usually for the sexy pictures or uh, also some good fan art of one of my favorite like stuff in media. Okay, hello, you wanna work for a little bit? I love three spoons. Oh yeah, it's the same thing. Uh, pineapple, okay, sure thing, I can do pineapples. Okay. So basically, in, like, you know, I, I was looking through DeviantArt, and then I just, I just found the DeviantArt picture of that YouTuber girl, and I was surprised, I mean, but I mean, of course, she did say that, uh, as a DeviantArt, but I was not expecting to, like, stumble upon it. Here we go. So, 
So I basically looked at her uh, at the DeviantArt uh, drawings and stuff, especially the ones of, that she drew of, of herself. And I honestly have to say, she looks really, she looks really sexy. Honestly, like, you know, um, this is she's actually my my kind of my type of girl of, of how she looks and stuff. So. <laughs> Did I got it then? I think I did. Maybe not. I don't know. Anyway, so so I actually looked at her pro, pro uh, at her at her at the pictures, and she looks really nice and stuff. And I have to say, she actually really looks like uh, an anime girl, uh, like one one of the. One of the anime uh, girls from a certain um, anime that I know. So I mean, she and I'm not kidding. She actually really looks like looks like one. So I mean, by I guess bonus points for that. Honestly, I'm not to say that a girl has to look like anime, but I'm just saying coincidentally she she looks like a she looks like an anime girl from something that I know from. Okay, I guess they never they never fall in. So let me let me do a different strat. Maybe we gotta stand back. Okay, so anyway. So so I have to say she looks she looks really attractive and stuff. And also another thing, she also she also has a few features like the looks and stuff of that not only of an anime girl, but also that cartoon girl, even from the sexy cartoon girl uh, from the previous uh, vlog. Where I talked about this attractive cartoon character from uh, from an animated movie from Asia, basically. Like she really looks like she really looks like it. <laughs> Fuck, where is it going? Okay, maybe I gotta I have to just jump and throw. Sorry about that. I mean, at least I'm talking until I finish this vid, so... Because I really want to talk about this, and then I'll talk about the serious stuff. Instead of talking about that part, and then the serious stuff, so... That's what I'm doing. Anyway, uh... So... So I have to say, she actually looks really attractive, and I'm really glad that I stumbled upon her deviant art. So I could like it just admire the pictures and stuff. Okay, I got it. Fuck, you have to do it like that. Okay. Okay, so So anyway, um what else? I mean I actually I mean she's I mean she's just really uh she's just really sexy, honestly. Uh, I wish I wish I had a girlfriend honestly. I really want really want to, to have one. I mean as of as uh, like as of right now I still don't have a girlfriend. I mean like not not trying to uh, pursue for one as of yet. I'm not gonna really talk about much of the girlfriend issue because as of right I like as of right now I don't have time, so I'll probably talk more about this later, about my uh, si my girlfriend, finding a girlfriend situation. Like, as of right now, I'm not really trying to find one, but like, want like just just wanting one, you know, basically. Not not just not really for sex, but you know, for for love and companionship. I never I never had that in my life, honestly. I don't even know I don't even know what it feels like, like having another human being that you're sexually attracted to, that you literally spend time with and stuff, and have some erotic sex and stuff, like, thanks, what did you say? Sweet, sweet time, what, 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 what did you say? I might just ask for your help again, oh, fuck it, like, I never, you know, I never had this, and instead all I do is just I watch porn and stuff in order to get to get rid of my like you know the sexual urges that I have and stuff. Let me see what what does she want. Work me up a little bit. 
Plus three stories of fruit and fruit stuff. Banana, bring me three. Oh, I know where they are. Okay. Will do. Anyway, so, uh, it's on this side. You're wrong. So that will- Oh, yeah, it's, it's, in, it's here, but like around the- So these are the durians, right here. Not gonna do them, because these, these are- Sorry, I was- uh, these were the only- these are the only kinds of fruits you can't carry, you have to kick around, and I don't want to do that. I'm really thankful for my mom giving me some time. So I could at least finish up on what I need to say. And I also finished the Bowser thing, so and then, like, in my next video I'll definitely talk about the serious stuff. One thing I'd like to mention is that um, I don't think I'll be able to do that tomorrow, like make a video, make a gameplay, because uh, I have to go to UT University of Tampa so I can deliver them my physical transcripts and make sure if everything is like set up all right for uh, transferring and, and like signing up for classes. So I need to, I have to make sure everything's good to go. So I will be waking up uh, early go to University of Tampa to do this. I don't know if I might come back on time. I might, but we'll see. Because Wednesday is also a class day that, um, like, that starts at 6, so we'll see on Wednesday. I'm recording this on a Tuesday, so I'm just saying. I love how these things reappear. It makes it less of a hassle. Ah, uh, fuck me. Fuck me. Sorry. Shit. Ah, uh, fuck. Ha, <laughs> it doesn't count for you. There we go. I give me a blue coin. Sweet turns. Oh, fuck. Okay, so they do say that, and... Uh, I don't know why I ignore it. Fuck, I'm sorry. Did, did they say sweet turns? I don't know. I guess one thing, one last thing I want to do, it's a challenge that you basically do get a shine sprite if you complete, and it doesn't take too long. Let me do that, and, uh, then I'll basically call it a day. I don't know, I just really, I just really want to do it. I, I have... It's 256. Uh, I'm hoping my mom might not. Actually, if she does show up, I can just tell her to just stay downstairs for a bit and to, to sign off, basically. I'm not talking about anything important as of now, so. Break all the crates within 30 seconds to win a prize. You wanna try? Yes. Uh, ah, fuck. Yeah, I know you have to do it. Hey, come on. Damn. Fuck. Fuck me. So close. I know what I had to do. I have to go in the corner, go in the side, so then it basically breaks them all at the same time, basically. So, something like this. You break two of them, but I just didn't, I just didn't do it early, because I thought it was, like, so simple to do. I was almost, I almost had it, but... That was great, you're the best. Yeah, free shine sprite. There's also the, another challenge of, of this again later, but I'm not gonna do it now. I, I just wanna collect the shine sprite. And that's it. Yeah, I basically talked about everything I needed to talk about. I finished Mecha Bowser, so that's that's basically it for cutscenes. Now I'm able to talk about the most 
the important stuff I need to talk about. And since I already finished Mecha Bowser, now basically is first ones is collect shine sprites and do Shadow Mario challenges. Usually, I'll, so the worlds I do. By the time I do the Shadow Mario challenge in this world, then that means I declare that world finished. Unless I need to collect shine sprites in general to advance to the next to the level, the one with the shine sprite on the ground, or the next level, I would continue collecting shine sprites. But by the time I, I get to the last level, the final level where you just collect shine sprites and then that's it, then I'll only focus on doing Shadow Mario challenges and nothing else. So that's basically what's gonna happen. So yeah, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.